Welcome to the Horror Show. I'm Brittany Lee. I'm Cece Von Slaughter. I'm in Fuego here. Hi, Rachel Parker. I'm Cecil Laird, and we're back for another trailer reaction. This time we're doing one that's called Havenhurst. Now, the trailers for this came out about seven months ago, and then I think a new trailer came out about four months ago. But we're finally getting a taste of it again. Sometimes these get past us, but it's going to be coming out, I think, February 10th or um, right around there. So we wanted to at least let you guys know about it because none of us knew about it until it's just this week. It's from the Saw producers? Yes, producers of Saw yeah. and I think maybe Insidious or one, something else mm. like that. But the reason I'm interested is because it stars Julie Benz, who was in uh, Dexter as his long-term wife. Um, okay, okay. Uh, and then also Danielle Harris, who is one of my favorite screen queens, who was the star of Hatchet 2 and 3, as well as a plethora of other things. She's got badass tattoos. She's an awesome, short, badass little scream queen. So I'm excited to see this. So wow. let's do it. Havenhurst, here we go. In 3, 2, 1, boom. One of New York's grandest buildings has a secret to die for. Terrible choice of voiceover. Terrible choice. No, it's an inner world kind of thing. Welcome to Havenhurst. I am very particular about those whom I choose as tenants. My friend. Danielle Hampton, she lived here. Yes. Is there a reason why I was given her old apartment? Danielle and Jason just happened to be the last tenants to vacate. Jason? I was just hoping that you might know where they went. Once they leave the building, one rarely hears from them again. <gasps> So I will remember you. Remember me? What is it? We should get out of here. Run! Where's Sarah? She's not here, Jackie. I'm not leaving without her. My dear. You're not leaving at all. You've been evicted. Run along. You don't have much time. trailer um, boom boom yeah oh, all right like, well uh, i wish that voice didn't start it out yeah that was i was already like freaking out the trailer wasn't bad after that but it's mm -hmm. such a terrible time yeah exactly yeah. Mm -hmm. again uh julie benz looks good daniel harris earning her scream queen crown at the end there as usual running around like she's the one that used to be there i guess that's who daniel harris is but mm -hmm. um it, just, it that, still it looks like, so like we're in the <laughs> age of generic trailers right yeah. now. I have a question. Mm -hmm. Can you really put on here as like the producers of Amityville The Awakening when we still haven't seen that movie? Yet? Well, sure. <laughs> like, it's still, it's still mean, got produced, even though it hasn't been released. I mean, like, around for a is year. that really a credit? <laughs> yes. <it's... laughs> if it's on the IMDb, it's official. That's I mean, the way it works. You know, That's well, the way it I'm works. I'm just saying, would I want to bring it up if a movie still hasn't been released? Sure. Right. Yeah, yeah like, if that's your only credit. Like, okay. Well, because as of right now, we don't technically know if it's bad yeah. for sure. Well, I know, but and, and it's well, been delayed like six times. It doesn't times. matter. It's still, money, we don't know. Right? Yeah, yeah, if it's the peeps who pumped money into that, though, I mean, of course they'd yeah, be like, yeah, 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 we did this uh, too. Exactly. And you're like, really? We did this um, since that one. <laughs> yeah, right? yeah. Because we're sitting around on that. Um, But yeah, so I don't know. Brittany, what were your thoughts? It, it's like 666 Park Avenue. 
but like sinister. Okay. Huh. All right. I can see what you're going with that. I okay. Mean, I don't know. That's what it kept. I, I know what you're saying. Yeah, that that was <laughs> that was six 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 Park Avenue was just a a, a a long version of the Devil's Advocate. Yeah, it essentially. was. It was. <laughs> um. So uh, I I I don't know. This but. doesn't look quite as interesting as that. But no. still, I get your point. I get but your point. It's got a vibe. Susie. I like her. I like the main. I don't remember what's her name again. The Julie Benz. That one. Mm -hmm. that one. Her? I like her. I really like her, and so I really want to like this. Mm -hmm. But like, uh, <laughs> I'm so torn because I want to see her. I really like her, but I'm not interested in anything else really that's going on. All right, Fuego. It looks okay. I mean, I was getting kind of a king vibe, but I usually do. I was getting a little bit of a 1408 Shining kind of kind of vibe to the proceedings, but the acting does not look bad. I'm just curious if this is one of those whole, she's dead, it's all in her head sort of thing. I mean, but I would watch it. It, it didn't look TTT, I'll give it that. I think that the cast is amazing. Mm -hmm. There's, ton, like, almost every person that I saw in there, and I was like, oh, they're in it? Mm -hmm. You know, so that does say a lot about a movie, was when you have so many credible actors, actresses, like, putting their name down on it. Um, it does kind of fall, because the way it was cut together, it kind of falls into that, like, I've seen it mm -hmm. category. Mm -hmm. um, a little mix of everything, and which I understand a lot of movies are like that anyway, but make us excited about it. Please. <laughs> Please. <laughs> <laughs> um, I thought they got, the villain looks cool. I want to hear the, his story. Mm -hmm. um, and he, I mean, he looks like almost a pyramid head type without the pyramid. Right. So I'd be interested to see what kind of because could it be kind of like a Silent Hill thing? Like, it's Maybe. all demented and crazy, and Look, yeah. nobody... If you get evicted, that seems like a really bad thing. <laughs> <laughs> you don't actually... They don't pack up your bags. They just pack up your body and do weird things to it, I'm imagining. Yeah, but. probably so. Well, well, those are our thoughts, you guys, on Havenhurst. Again, it should be available very soon, so if you're interested, let us know down in the comments below. Were you aware of this one, or... Um, even if not, if so, whatever, let us know if this trailer excites you or if there was, if, I think there was another trailer. Um, so maybe that one didn't have that awful voiceover to start. So, <laughs> yeah. Ugh, is that this was a, so rough. Is this going to theaters or is this VOD? No, VOD. Oh, okay. Yeah. okay. Yeah. Uh, that makes more sense. Yeah. Um, yeah, VOD but, in February, uh, I believe. I think so too, yeah. yeah February 3rd. But don't discount it because it's actually. VOD. Um, um, so. a lot of good no, he discounted it because of the opening. Oh. <laughs> like that. Just, <laughs> so, did you do the whole thing? No, it was, just the, it was just the start, but that was enough to ruin it. Yep. So, thanks very much for watching, guys. Again, leave a comment down below what you thought. Also, while you're down there, click the link in the description box to our Tee Public store where you can get some awesome horror show swag or some really cool horror mashup swag. And if you do, it'll all go towards helping the show. Or not all, but some of it will go towards helping the show, so it'll be supporting us. We appreciate it. Thank you very much for your time. I've been Cecil Laird. I'm Brittany Lee. I'm Cecil Von Slaughter. Gracias, I'm Amin Fuego. Marsha Parker. Remember, stay, stay scared. scared.